God bless everyone. So I know this video is probably going to be extremely different because I'm just talking in it. I'm not in the camera. Um, it is about 10.02 right now. It's October 1st. Um, I've been holding off on uh, filming this video for you guys because I just... It's been on my mind already since it has happened. Um, three days ago, um, I woke up early morning and I know that Jesus woke me up. He wakes me up every morning, early morning, around three, four, two. It just all depends. Um, my daughter is next to me if you guys hear her, but... So I woke up early, early this in the morning, about three nights ago, and I didn't want to, I could, like I said, I put it off. I, I didn't want to film because I just didn't want to, like, come on here and say any random thing, like, about what I saw. So it's been on my mind, and I've been thinking about it, and it just kept, like, popping up in my mind throughout the day, like, what I saw. I'm going to post a picture right now literally right now of what i was shown um during prayer and um it's amazing like god is awesome but oh my goodness it's amazing like god is so good we are living in such short time right now we have no time no time jesus is coming um, I prayed and I said, Jesus, if there's anything you want to tell me, show me, um, communicate with me, please let me know. Just let me know. And I was sitting on the edge of my bed and I was talking to Jesus as I was telling him that. And I had my eyes closed and I, <laughs> I saw a tree. Okay. And what stood out from this tree were the branches. And the tree had no leaves. This was a tree. It was a leafless tree. Okay. So I started watching this uh, video on... Uh, prior to watching the video on YouTube, I'm going to go ahead and pop up the verse. But the verse talks about the fig tree and when the branches are like soft and when the leaves there is no more, something like that. That, like in other words, God is near, Jesus is near. Um, it's a parable about the fig tree. But you guys will see obviously what verse I'm talking about right now. And then I went ahead and I was like, hmm. When I read that, like, I literally just read this a couple minutes ago. Like, I tell you guys, I've been thinking about this tree thing that I saw during prayer. And I'm like, okay, God. So, eventually you'll let me know what it is. And this is it. This verse that I just read made me think about the tree that I was shown during prayer three nights ago. And God, in other words, is saying that there is no more time left. Like, God is at the door. The trumpet it's going to sound and we are going to get raptured and we're going to be out of here. That's it. We're going to fly away. We're going to be with Jesus so soon. Guys, a tree, no leaves, meaning winter is near. We are in October already. And I was hearing, you know, I don't set dates or times or anything like that, but I was seeing all over YouTube, like October 5th and 7th is like a high um rapture watch time and things like that but guys things are getting worse and scarier i mean of course we don't have to fear because we are children of god we trust and believe in jesus and we are sealed with god's salvation and all that but it's amazing that i was shown this because god is letting us know he's letting me know to let you guys know and it's crazy look Anyways, like I was saying, um, 
I then decided literally a couple minutes ago, I'm like, hmm, let me go ahead and look up a fig tree. Like, how does a leafless fig tree look like? I looked that picture up and this is what I found. Isn't that crazy, guys? It looks like the identical tree that I saw. Anyways, when I saw the tree, I said, like I was saying, what stood out were the branches and there were no leaves on it. Guys, Jesus is coming. Let's get into prayer. Let's stay close to God. There's a lot of distractions. The devil is a liar and we rebuke him in the name of Jesus. He's trying to distract our minds. He's trying to put doubt that god is not coming jesus is coming things are getting worse and we are going to be out of here really soon guys i just wanted to enlighten your day night wherever you guys are at, around the world and share this with you guys again i didn't want to come on here and just be like yeah i saw a tree and i, I was like i didn't know it didn't come i didn't come to my mind at first until okay now i understand what God was telling me like my jaw dropped when I came to realize like, after I read that verse I was like oh my gosh that matches what I saw and that's exactly what I saw during prayer guys stay blessed Jesus is coming and let's just continue staying strong in the Lord Let's forgive our brothers and sisters that have offended us. Let's just love, spread love, and continue loving. And let's just continue seeking the face of God and just putting all of our worries, all of our burdens, everything in God's hands. And also really quick before I get off of here, my son has fever. His name's Eli. I would really appreciate it if you guys would put him in prayer. Um, right now, he's resting. It is late, but he's resting right now. And yeah, I would really appreciate it if you guys put prayer for him that he can feel better by tomorrow and eat because he hasn't eaten all day. He munched on some crackers and drank juice, but he hasn't been feeling the best. Um, but yeah, guys, I'll talk to you guys all later. God bless. Bye.